What up fellas, uh, Iron Jazzy here and I'm back for another Transformers uh, video review and yes, I'm doing another Transformers The Last Night toy review and that is the Deluxe Class Premier Edition Bumblebee Yes, I already reviewed Barricade from yesterday and yes, you guys saw both of them from my haul video from last time at Nashville while well, I was at Nashville and of course my aunt Got him and Barricade, since I want to thank her for that. I know how much she loves me. I know how much I loved her. And of course, she picked him up at Walmart. And of course, yes, once again, that was from Nashville. And of course, we're going to get started with the review as well. So, let me set my iPad down and show B to you guys. So... I seen reviews of him on YouTube. Well, of course, yes, I posted a video on YouTube. While well, I seen reviews of him, maybe like a few or a lot, I don't know. But here he is in his exact same repainted vehicle mode. Now this vehicle mode is the exact same one from AOE, but in a different kind of yellow accurate. So here's the front, the top. As well, I wish Hasbro painted that in that section black instead of yellow. And here's the side. And the other side, we have an Autobot symbol in yellow. And here's the back of him. Trying to get that part detached there. And of course, he has a black license plate and the red lights as well. And a little Chevy symbol as well. And on the bottom, we have his black shurikens and his body as well. But, compare it with that AOE one, I think it's the same but different. Well, it kind of uh, tries to make it accurate to that new Chevy Camaro look, that new one that we've seen images before. Well, I think it's almost like that one already. Well, that new one is coming out too for Wave 2 already. Well, I want to get that so bad. And he does come with his instructions how to transform him into his robot mode as well. Actually, this is his vehicle mode. What am I even saying? And this is his robot mode that you gotta transform him. Also, here's the other figures that are available. I'm not getting slashed though because he's not in the movie. Well, I already have Barricade, but I don't have Berserker either. So, I might want to get him. But I'll see I'll get Berserker. But not Slash. Well, he's not in the movie, too. So, the transformation is the exact same one from AoE. So, all you have to do is take those shurikens off of his feet. Yes, there is the plug for them. And that's what it looks like without them. But, anyways, how to transform him is the same. You pull his arms out out of the front part of the car and take the arms out and fold the window parts there just like so and try and make it fully go out as well and this section you can open it and this part goes all the way down as well and fold that back. Take this area, and it's already detached. And twist them. Do the same thing on the other leg. And detach this. And I'm trying to get the foot out. There we go. Fold that in. Take it out. And do the same thing on the other leg. If I could show it to you. 
There we go. Pull that in and take it out. And there. And of course, it is an easy transformation for B. Well, it's not that bad. Well, when I got this same old version of himself from last Christmas years ago, I thought it's going to be harder for me here yeah, when I got his other old repaint like this for last Christmas, but it's easy to transform him back into a Chevrolet Camaro. But, now he has his robot mode and a repaint one. Now, yes, once again, it is a repaint for his robot mode. Let me fix that part. There we go. And yes, it is the same exact repaint one. Well, I think it's macaroni and bumblebee cheese. Don't get me wrong. Well, I never said that before. Don't judge me, guys. Please don't kill me in the comments. So, we're going to take a look at him. So, the head sculpt is the si I'm sorry about that, guys. Forget what I said. It's the exact same one from the other one. We have the Albot symbol on his head. And here's the same chest. Same leg design, looking nice. And here's the top part, looking good, as well as the same exact arms. Turn around, there's the back part. We have the hoodie for the car. I'm sorry, hood part for the car as well. And of course, looking really cool looking. The bottom of the feet are different as well looking really fantastic looking so he has the exact same articulation the head moves up and down no side to side to look his arms kind of fully rotate but this part is blocking it and the shoulder pads move in and out then two points on the elbow as well, no hand movement, and the same thing on that arm as well. And legs move forward, not that a little bit back because of that part that's blocking in the way. And of course, bend two points on the knee as usual. And of course, no ankle pivot side to side. Well, he has some in and out feet movement. Well, that's a part of the transformation. Also, Bumblebee has the exact same transformation hand. It is the exact same cannon blaster as well. But Hasbro painted it different inside. Instead, the old one from AOE. And where are you going to put the two shurikens? Well, see these pickles? There's the detachment, as always. And you plug it into his back. And also, I forgot to mention, this part moves to why uh, trying to make it go up into that part. But I'll do it at the end of the video. I'll try. And the same thing on there as well. And he looks not that bad with the shurikens on. He looks like Stinger to me, but in a different look. And of course, you ready for him to bow Nemesis Prime. And as well, the other baddies. Let me get that cannon out. And there. By which he does come with that club that we saw in the movie, but I wish they do it on Wave 2 with his new version. In this, well, I hope they get at both of them to these different bumblebees. But once again, I'm obsessed with this bumblebee. Well, it's the exact same one from AOE, and yes, I kind of said it too much in this review. Well, you guys reviewed him before since I watched your awesome videos of him, and of course. 
He looks not that bad. Well, I like the shurikens on him. And it looks not that bad. I wish he had more weapons. Instead of that cannon blaster. Once again, I wish he had the club. For this B as well. But it's not that bad. Well, the repaint for his vehicle mode is not that bad looking. Well, I'm sorry guys. I was wiping my iPad. Well, yeah, I was wiping it. But it looks pretty good actually. Since I like how the touches to it, it almost looks like that new Chevrolet touch to it, that new one with that new color on his uh, body parts as well and his vehicle mode too. But I wish we had the new one in Wave 1, but I wish the Wave 2 ones come out early so I could get them as well as Drift and Squeaks and Berserker, but still not getting Slash because he's not in the movie too. So that's it now guys, thank you all for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new, and click the bell, if you're on your laptop and computer, make sure to smack that save button as well, and of course there's a link in the description, hit the comment section down below, and of course, hit that thumbs up as well. I'll see you later alligators.